What's up guys? Welcome back. I'm Matt Blarks. Uh So today, I'm on my way to my friend's house. We're gonna go and work on his uh, Lexus GS300. Um, he already started pulling out some stuff. So I'm gonna be there, help him out, guide him a little bit. See you when we get there. Drive. We're here at uh, Mike's place, and uh, we're gonna head down and uh, see what's going on. It's Mike. Welcome to the channel. Uh, Want to bang? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Let's see what's going on. Ooh. Oh look, what is this? Look, there's there's the wheels. Yeah. What the fuck's an M12? M12 what? Ah, so here we go, he pulled off the majority of the manifold. Uh, sure, it looks like there's a lot of work left to do, <laughs> but we'll get to it. Yeah, we need to pull off this this radiator and the, the fan shroud. Okay, we got a lot of work to get to the head. So Mike's gonna go ahead and start working on the uh, fan assembly and the radiator. Should be easy. I'm probably gonna start figuring out the rest of the harness on this side. So we got fan shroud radiator out, connectors for the harness off this side. It's we're working on the other side. Um, yeah, there's a lot of connectors beneath. Let's go to that side. So there's a lot of connectors beneath the manifold that lead to this. Uh, once we get that out, then we can pull the um, harness out. Lean it this way. And once we get the harness out. We can pull off this bottom manifold and then uh, work on the timing, pull off the valve covers. Okay, it's recording. <laughs> Question is, uh, 
what else is there? I don't know if still in the way. One eternity later. No? Uh, oh, I just moved it now. Can't take out the other one. Give me a big ass ratchet that will not fit in that space there. I don't know where's the other ratchet. <laughs> All right, so we got pre four. We got the intake manifold off. Mike got the exhaust manifold separate from the head. Couldn't take it off from the, the exhaust itself. Uh, we're gonna go try and do timing. I need to go research and see how to do this timing. Fuck. <laughs> All right, so I got TDC, I think. <laughs> and timing mark here. Timing mark here is line up to that, and it's also on the crank is a little off. That's weird. <laughs> uh, probably will bring it back a little bit. But uh, yeah, go ahead and take off the tensioner, turbine belt tensioner. Take off the water water pump pulley. I wish I had my compressor to take off the crank pulley easier, but um, we'll go ahead and take off the valve cover and uh, take it from there. All right, so we got some issues taking off the crank pulley. I need to get my compressor, bring it here. We'll probably do that next week, so it's a lot easier. Uh, we tried to crank it off manually. <laughs> it didn't help. But uh, yeah, we kept messing up the timing, so and it's really, really tight. It's probably torqued to spec and it's old. This fucking dead cat really annoys the shadow of me. Anyways, so that's it for today. Uh, we got the take manifold off. Um, next episode on the GS, we should be having the head off. And um, we'll see. Hopefully the head's not cracked. Hopefully. Because oh, <laughs> we don't know how, gonna... we don't know the extent of the overheating. So um, that's basically it. All right, so like this video. Comment if you want to see more stuff on the GS300. You probably do. And then uh, subscribe, that'll help a lot. And if we get to 100 subscribers, we are going to give away a shirt. One of my shirts. So um, that's it. Uh, be safe, wash your hands, and uh, wear your mask. Oh, somebody!